iPhone keyboard has suddenly started lagging. Maybe it feels slow, letters appear late, or typing freezes for a second? You're not alone. In this video, I'll walk you through all the effective methods to fix it. Each one explained with a simple intro, so you understand why you're doing it and how it helps. Let's start with the easiest fixes and move to the slightly advanced ones. Method 1. Turn off heavy keyboard features. The iPhone keyboard has features like haptics, predictions, smart punctuation, slide typing, and autocorrection. Turning them off reduces background load and makes typing instantly smoother. Open settings. Scroll down and tap on the general option. Scroll down and tap on the keyboard option. From here, turn off features like haptics, predictions, smart punctuation, slide typing, and autocorrection. Two, reset the keyboard dictionary. Over time, your iPhone learns new words, custom shortcuts, misspellings, and typing patterns. If this learned data becomes corrupted, your keyboard may freeze, slow down, or skip letters. Resetting the dictionary clears all learned entries and restores typing speed. Open settings. Scroll down and tap on the general option. Now scroll down again and tap on the transfer or reset your iPhone. From here, tap on the reset option. And from the options, tap on the reset keyboard dictionary option. Enter your passcode to confirm. Now tap on the Reset Dictionary again to reset the keyboard dictionary. Three, remove and re-add the keyboard. Sometimes the keyboard itself glitches, especially after an update. Deleting the keyboard and adding it again forces iOS to rebuild the keyboard engine, which clears hidden bugs. Open settings. Scroll down and tap on the general option. Scroll down and tap on the keyboard option. Now tap on the keyboards option. From here, click on the edit and remove the keyboard. Now. Go back and tap on the keyboard option again. Now, to add a new keyboard, tap on Add New Keyboard. Now, tap on the keyboard you want to add and select Style. Click on the OK option in the top right corner to add a new keyboard. Now, if you want to remove the old keyboard, click on the Edit option again and remove the old keyboard to use the new keyboard style as the default. Four, disable accessibility features like slow keys. Under accessibility settings, iPhones have features like slow keys, sticky keys, and key repeat. Turning them off fixes the input delay immediately. Open settings. Scroll down and tap on the accessibility option. Scroll down again and tap on the keyboard and typing settings.
find sticky keys and slow key settings and ensure they are turned off. Five, force restart your iPhone. A force restart resets low-level system processes, clears RAM, and fixes bugs affecting the keyboard engine. How to force restart your iPhone. Press and release volume up and press and release volume down. Next, hold the side button until the Apple logo appears. Then, wait for some time until your iPhone reboots. Six, remove third-party keyboards. Keyboards like Grammarly, SwiftKey, Gboard, etc. run heavy background services, AI prediction engines, and cloud sync features. When they lag, your entire typing experience slows down, even if you're using Apple's keyboard. Scroll down and tap on the general option. Scroll down and tap on the keyboard option. Now, tap on the Keyboards option. From here, click on the Edit and remove the keyboard. Seven, update iOS and apps. Many keyboard issues come from bugs in iOS or laggy apps. Updating your iPhone and updating apps makes sure everything is optimized for the latest iOS version. Open Settings. Scroll down and tap on the General option. Now in the General Settings, tap on the iPhone Storage option. Now wait for the update to load. If any software update is available, tap on the update and enter your password to update your iPhone to the latest version. Here's how to update apps on your iPhone. Open the App Store. Click on the profile picture located in the top right corner of the screen. Scroll down to the list of apps that need to be updated. Tap on the Update All to update all the apps. Eight, free up storage space. Keeping at least 10 to 15% storage free improves typing and overall responsiveness. Here is how to clear storage on your iPhone. Open settings. Scroll down and tap on the general option. Now, in the General Settings, tap on the iPhone Storage option. From here, you can see how much storage is occupied on your iPhone. To free up storage, scroll down and check which apps are consuming more storage and delete them. You can also delete downloaded files to free up more storage.
and check if you can delete other files, such as photos or more apps, to free up more storage. Nine, close and reopen the app. To force close apps on your iPhone, go to the Recents app screen and swipe up the app. This will force close the app on your iPhone. Now, reopen the app. Finally, factory reset your iPhone to fix any issues as a last resort. Ensure you back up important files before proceeding to this step. Here's how to factory reset your iPhone. Open Settings. Scroll down and tap on the General option. Now scroll down again and tap on the Transfer or Reset your iPhone. From here, tap on the Erase All Content and Settings option. Next, click on the Continue. Now confirm this action by tapping on the Erase iPhone option. That's it! If prompted, enter your password and wait until your iPhone resets. These are the most effective methods to fix keyboard lag on your iPhone. For most users, disabling heavy features, removing third-party keyboards, or doing a force restart makes the biggest difference. I hope you find this guide helpful.